Translation of verbal phrases into mathematical phrases. Panuorin ng video ng ito at ituturo ko sa iyo. Okay, this is our topic: a translation of verbal phrases into mathematical phrases. The symbol of operation and relations with their corresponding meaning are as follows. Ito yung symbols niya. Una, we have a plus sign. So yung meaning, addition plus increased by added to the sum of and more than. Okay, another one, yung minus sign. So yung meaning, subtraction, minus, decreased by, subtracted from, less than, and diminished by. Okay, we have another symbol, yung multiplication, yung times, tapos dot, tapos close and open parenthesis. So yung meaning ito, multiplication, times, multiplied by, And the product of another one. So ito yung symbol. Then ito yung meaning: division divided by ratio of and the quotient of. Okay. So another symbol: yung equal sign. So meaning nya equals is equal to. Okay. Another one. Yan. So is less than. Meaning is less than. Then Symbol ng greater than is greater than. Another symbol is less than or equal to or is at most. Another one. So, symbol na yan is greater than or equal to or is at least. And last symbol is not equal to. Okay, I will give you an example. Okay, this is our example number one. So we have to translate verbal phrases into mathematical phrases. So first we have ten added to twice a number x. So gawin natin yung ten added to, di ba yung meaning yung itong na simbol nyan? Added to plus, di ba? The sum of so ten added to twice a number x. Ayan. Twice a number x. Claro. So another example, number two, a number n decreased by five. A number n, yung symbol ng decrease is ito, di ba? Pwede ring minus, diminish, pwede, di ba? So a number n decreased by five. Ayan. Okay. So number three, a number y multiplied by seven. Pwede ring A number y multiplied by 7. Pero dapat mauna yung uh, numerical coefficient. So, dapat 7y. A number y multiplied by 7. Pwede rin kasi magkabaliktad dyan eh. Di ba? So, pwede yung ganito. Number y multiplied by 7. Or 7y. 7y pa rin ang result nyan. y times 7 is 7y. So, 7y pa rin ang result nyan. Okay? So, twice. Number 4. Twice a number a. Divided by three, twice a number a divided by three. Okay, pero twice a number a divided by three, twice a number a divided by three. Okay, number five, the product of x and the square of y. The product of x who and the square of y. Lagyan ng Squared or exponent na squared yung y. The product of x and the square of y. So this is your final answer sa ating example number 5. Now let's proceed to another example. Okay, number 6 example. A number a subtracted from 8. Okay, so magiging 8 minus 8. A number a subtracted from 8. Okay, so ito yung mathematical price niya. So number 7 twice naku the product of 3 and x okay twice the product of 3 and x we're doing twice the product of 
3 and X. Okay, kahit saan na, pwede. So, number 8. Number 1, ay, number N. A number N divided by 4. Yung madali lang to. A number N divided by 4. You can use this symbol. Pwede rin. A number N divided by 4. Okay, kahit saan ha, pwede. So, number 9. A number X increase by 6. So, increase yung symbol niya plus sign, di ba? A number X increase by 6. Okay, so yun ang tamang sagot sa number 9. Number 10. So, 5 times the number Y. 5, eh, 5 times the number Y. Or pwede rin 5 times Y or 5Y. Okay, pwede ganyan ha? Or 5 times a number Y. Okay, kahit saan dyan, pwede, o tama. Okay, let's proceed to another example. Okay, number 11. The sum of 5 and tries a number X. Okay, the sum of 5, sum, di ba, plus, and tries a number X. Okay, the sum of 5 and tries a number X. A number x. Okay, to you mathematical phrase na number eleven. Number twelve. Twice the square of a number x. Twice the square of a number x. Ayan. Twice the square of a number x. Pwede ring twice the square of another x. Of another x. The square of x. As the square of a number x. Ano ba? Okay. Twice The square of a number x. Okay. So number thirteen, twice the sum. Okay, twice the sum. The sum of three and x. Okay, ito yun the sum, di ba? Twice the sum of three and x. So number fourteen, one less than the product of three and x. The product of 3 and x that was minus 1 or less than man ba? 1 less than the product of 3 and x. So 3x minus 1. So number 15, 4 subtracted from tries a number x. So so a 4 subtracted from tries a number x. Tries a number x minus 4. Okay. So, 4 subtracted from tries a number x. So, this is your final answer sa ating example number 15. Okay, let's proceed to another example. Okay, number 16. A number C increased by 1 half. Okay, a number C increased. Diba yung mga meaning ng symbol ng increase? Sama yung plus, diba? Increased by. So, C increased by 1 half. Okay, ito yung mathematical price niya. So, number 17, one-third plus a number N. One-third plus a number N. Okay? So, number 18, lapit na tayo. The product of X and 3. The product of X and 3. We did ring X and 3. Pero dapat mauna yung ano ha? Mauna yung numerical coefficient. So, the product of X and 3. Ganyan. Okay? Pwede rin the product of x and 3. Pwede magkabaliktan. Okay, so number 19, the quotient of n and 2. So the quotient of n and 2. Pwede rin the quotient of n and 2. Okay, so last example, number 20. The square of the product of x and y. Okay, the product of x and y. Tapos yung square niya. Ayan. So, the square of the product of x and y. The square of, the square of the product of x and y. So, this is your final answer. Uh, gusto ko lang i-shout out ang aking mga bagong kaibigan dyan sa Organic Barkadas. Mega mega love shout out sa ating lahat dyan. And of course, uh, Team Rampa. Mega mega shout out Rampa pa more And uh, Siyempre Sa team Panga Mega mega love shout out sa ating lahat At maraming salamat 
mga kapatid. God bless and I love you all. At maraming maraming salamat sa panunood. At kung hindi ka pa nakapag-subscribe sa channel ko, please subscribe para updated ka sa lahat ng mga videos na i-upload ko. See you to my next videos. Bye-bye!